Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe, like the video if you like it, and share it to friends think might need it. This video was requested by someone down in the comments. If you have something you'd like me to do, leave it down in the comments and I'll check it out. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. So, this is also going to be extremely repetitive. You're going to hear the same pretty much um, rift repeated that entire song. There's going to be one part that's also different, and then there's going to be like a bridge part which is going to be a little difficult to play because it's a couple of instruments being played at once so you have like from what i hear is like the violin maybe a cello maybe some bass so it's kind of hard to pick out what is being played in a bridge so the guitar is going to be in standard tuning your strings going to be in open strings so you don't need a capo so the main riff is just going to be from e flat to d flat major seven so it's just pretty much that so that's pretty much what you're mainly going to be playing for most of the song so sometimes you're going to hear like the riff um sometimes you're going to hear that riff I don't want to I don't want to explain it to you guys cuz I myself still have, haven't figured out the riff but roughly it's fifth string sixth fret fifth string fourth fret fourth string sixth fret third string third fret third string fifth fret third string fourth fret and then fourth string sixth fret fifth string seventh fret Fourth string, eighth fret, fifth string, seventh fret, and then fifth string, sixth fret. So slowly. So I'm not exactly sure if that's the riff that's being played, but it's somewhat what is what I hear. But I still haven't figured it out yet, so that's kind of to just give you guys like a rough idea. But honestly, you could just play this. You could just play that and you'll be fine. So next part is going to be A flat major 7, but that's going to be 6th string, 4th fret. 4th string, 5th fret, 3rd string, 5th fret, 2nd string, 4th fret. So strong pattern is going to be down, 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 down. Then C minor, play that's going to be 5th string, 4th string, 5th fret, 3rd string, 5th fret, 2nd string, 4th fret. So F minor, play that's going to be 6th string, 1st fret, 5th string, 3rd fret, 4th string, 3rd fret, 3rd string, 1st fret, 2nd string, 1st fret. F minor, you're going to play the strong pattern there two times. So 1, so for that part you're gonna repeat the progression four times so to the next part again next part is you're going to be playing it's just going to be that part until you get to the bridge then the bridge is somewhat going to be the more not difficult but harder to figure out part because again it's a lot of instruments clashing at once but from what i hear it's going to be f minor and then C minor and then F to play an F chord same thing as F minor just put your finger on 3rd string 2nd fret and then D flat major 7 once and then F minor and then E minor play that it's going to be 6th string open 5th string 2nd fret 4th string 2nd fret 3rd string open 2nd string open and then you just bounce back from D flat major 7 to G flat major 7 
but that's gonna be the same times as A flat major seven. Just move it down two frets, and just go back and forth between those two chords three times. And then after you do that, you're gonna go back to what you've always played, which is. You're gonna play that for a couple of times, like six times. The rest of the song from that point on to like the outro is gonna be. That's pretty much how the song sounds like. So it's how the whole song sounds like all together. The uh, track I'm going to be using is going to be the one that was uploaded on YouTube. It's called May Simone's Inaka at Public Records, a uh, home screen show. So that's what I'm going to be using as the track for the playthrough. <laughs> If this video helped, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to more videos like this, share it to friends think might need it, leave a comment down below on what story you'd like to see next, and I'll see you next time.